Hey guys, real quick before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this Civilization 6 video. Helps me out a ton, takes no effort at all, and will help keep you updated whenever I come out with another similar video. Anyways, let's get started. We don't even have 250, well we do have 253 turns left in the game. Uh, new district build, I guess me. I guess me again. I guess me for the third time. Ooh, I actually had diplomatic favor to spend, that sucks. I didn't get any. Eleanor's actually close. So hold up. 15, that is going to be a problem. Uh, let's repair that market. We'll go next turn. Uh, we do have two envoys we can send, actually. Why are all the city-states getting destroyed? Okay, Geneva. Geneva. We're, we need Geneva. Production-wise, though, we'll go for the... Hmm, hydrolytic Dam. Don't need that yet. Um... Hmm... Could get Ruhr Valley production-wise. That would be insanely helpful. Let's get Ruhr Valley. Okay, let's see. Smart Materials is there, so we'll get that. But I don't think this tech, this tech is almost definitely not going to be the tech we need. So after that, we'll beeline over there, into there. Why on earth do I need that technology? No, we're going Robotics into Smart... Robotics, Smart Materials, into that. Why would I... Why would I need this technology? Oh, because it's connected. I didn't see that line over there. Never mind. Uh, Production-wise in this city. Oh, Petra. Uh, let's get a bank going. We'll go next turn. Perfect. Mansa Musa does not like me. Eh, it's fine. We're now making negative 27 gold per turn. That's not looking too good for us. We get communism, though, so yay, communism. Don't think anyone's ever said that in a while. Uh, let's go drill manuals and loyalty per turn, I think. Just loyalty per turn. And over here we can get domestic... Ooh, collectivization's massive. And gold and production from cities not on your capital's continent, so almost all of them. Perfect. And after that, trade routes from all trade routes. I like that. We're actually going to replace it with rationalism. Yes. We'll replace it with rationalism for now. And then we will now put uh, open borders and foreign influence points. There we go. We're going to make a lot more gold now, but a little bit less science, which is fine. It's fine. I'll take that any day of the week. Um, do you have the spaceport? Yes, you do. Perfect. Okay. Now you are going to go for campus research grants. We are about that time right now. Get a factory. Here you can get a 225 for a spaceport. I like that. I like the sound of that. And Samusa doesn't like me. Occupy one of his ally cities. Makes sense, honestly. But hey, Eleanor's starting to like me too, so I guess hoes before bros in this scenario. There's robotics. Nice. Cold War. Um, yeah, we're gonna go smarter. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Fine. Next turn. Um, peace be to you. Don't know what that is, but fine. Uh, another flood. That is suckish. Renew the mission for the spaceport. Um... Population could be helpful. Ask of the Forbidden said, just get a bank. Yep, more money. More envoys going to Geneva. I do need that small bonus that could help us. Right after Roar Valley, we'll do the Exoplanet Expedition. And do we have those great people yet? Production towards Space Race. We're going to get that soon. Might as well spend the faith on it, though. Yeah, no reason not to. And then India's going to get this thing that doesn't really matter. Okay. Spend the faith on this great engineer. 20% production of the space race. I like that. And this dude. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's food production and gold now. 118 production. And you still have an amenity problem. You could have even more than that. That is massive. Let's go for audience chamber, I guess. One amenity, three housing and cities with governors. Ooh, that could help Cyan, though. Um, can we make peace with this guy yet? We've been at war for like 100 turns now. How about I give you some spices? There we go. Everybody likes spices. We'll go for now, I guess a spaceport. Spaceport's everywhere. That's what we're going to do next turn. Could get into a gold. Ah, four turns. We're probably not going to get a golden age. Hmm. There we go. Off-world mission advanced. Wait. There is off-world mission. Perfect. Boosted through a spy. Nice. Don't know how. I don't have any spies in any, any territories, but still. 20% uh, production towards space race projects. That's good for us. Exoplanet Expedition, looking good. Um, I guess Hydrolytic Dam, so we can build those spaceport parts. 
Probably should have built a few more spaceports, but I guess it's fine. Um, world climate is starting to go up by a lot. Uh, we should be kind of insured for a science victory, though. They're smart materials, I guess. We'll go next turn now. Looking at all these other victories. No, yeah, culture, no one's close. Um, it's because I have so much tourism protection against Eleanor, she's not going to be able to win. Um, religious, no one's close. Diplomacy, that's the one, That's the only one where Eleanor is close. Every other victory type, not even close. Uh, let's go for Heartbeat of Steam, because that's the only one that makes sense. And I guess they still have three cities. This is fine. Uh, let's go for an... Hmm. You actually have the spaceport. Nice. Campus research grants. Actually, you can't do campus research grants, huh? Trader, maybe? There we go, trader. Uh, you can't build a trader. That's fine. Stock exchange. Can't build a spaceport either. Well, we do have a number of spaceports. That is campus research grants all the way. Let's get the last governor. Reign of the financer. And completes your staff with capable advisors. Okay, you get error score for that. I, you probably get an achievement for that too, but I probably got it sometime before. That is what I am thinking. We have plenty of faith. Is there a great 100% production towards spaceship parts? That is the scientist. Yeah, we're making way too many great scientist points. Oh, yeah. We're going to get that one. Probably don't even need him, to be honest. But we are going to get Suzerainty of Geneva, putting us at 708 science per turn. Let's see if we can get to 1,000 this game. Although I highly doubt it, but still. All right, turn 250. So we didn't meet our goal of winning the game before turn 250. That's fine. Um... I guess a spaceport, just in case we need it. We'll go next turn now. Roar Valley's going to be completed next turn. We'll be friends, yes. Probably going to win in the next 30 turns max. There's Roar Valley. And where is Mars? Eight turns for the Mars colony. That's good. Um, campus research grants. Industrial zone logistics. Whoever has a spaceport, I'm just going to put on campus research grants. So that when the time comes and I need all the spaceports to start building uh, boosters and whatnot, I'll know which cities have them. Uh, yes, trade route back to Zion, who has 160 production now. And it still could have a lot more if we had the amenities for it. Uh, Production-wise, campus research grants, because I think you have a spaceport. Yes, spaceport. 630 science, looking good. Guangzhou giving me five extra production. Let's do it. Uh, 165k. Here, um, do you have, you have a spaceport, campus research grants. Campus research grants all the way. Five more turns, and how long until we get that technology? Still gonna be a decent amount of time. About 13 more, 14 more turns. Um, spaceport, I guess. Nothing much else for you to do. We'll go next turn now. Almost to the end of the game, we'll take the small gold per turn increase. We're making 29 gold per turn, 32 now. There's advanced AI, we'll go next turn again. In about 10 turns, Research Alliance, thank you, we'll be on the Smart Materials Off-World Mission thing. That is the last thing we need for a science victory. Get me a spaceport, good. We're at 650 right now. We were at 700 a while ago, don't know what happened. Um, you have the, yes, okay, Campus Research Grants. I think I'm gonna, yeah, campus research grants. And we're gonna launch the Mars colony this turn. Actually, absolutely perfect. Nice. Capitalism achieved. Giant death robot. We might as well. We don't have the maintenance for it, but still, we might as well. Um, campus research grants. Uh, oh no, what am I doing? Am I retarded? Exoplanet expedition. Then Cusco can be the one that goes uh, giant death robot. Nice. Actually, transfer this guy back to Zion for more production. Even though it's at 166 right now. Absolutely massive. Uh, we could get double that production, though. Mm. Not yet, though. Yeah, not yet. We don't have any great engineers we need either. We should be fine. Let's go Manhattan Project. <laughs> do you have the spaceport? You do. Campus Research Grants. Here, Biblos, you don't have the spaceport. Might as well put it so it stops annoying me. Um, you already have max trade route, so you can just go to sleep. We'll go next turn now. Uh, 23 population. You are looking fine. Ooh, we could put even more on science, but nah, we won't do that. Uh, let's get... Hmm, intelligence agency, I guess. Might as well. 
cybernetics in four more turns. Then I think one more tech, and then we can do off-world mission. Bank, next turn. Uh, I do care about space too much. No, no, no. Off-world mission. Six turns, and we'll be able to start building off-world mission. Uh, nothing here that can help us. Production-wise, let's get a mm, campus research grants. That is what we need. Next turn, five more turns until the off-world mission. So it actually times up perfectly, right? Because five turns and five turns until we can start building those things. So that's good. Um, actually going to take that from Eleanor. Yeah, tourism. Even though culture-wise, she has no shot of winning. No, not before I win. The one thing she could do is a diplomatic victory. 243 turns. Yeah, diplomacy, she's at 15. It would suck if she won a diplomatic victory. Um... Yeah, you can do that. You can go to production. We'll go next turn. How long until? Five turns until the next session. So she's going to get two from winning. Ooh, this could be an issue, actually. She only has 156 diplomatic favor. Actually, oh my god, I almost destroyed my mic. Um, it says one turn. We are going to throw everything at her in hopes of getting all her diplomatic favor so she can't succeed. Succeed. There's off-world mission all the way to future tech. We'll go next turn. Three turns remaining. There we go. Exoplanet expedition. It is about that time. Terrestrial laser station. Lagrange laser station. Terrestrial laser station. Um, I don't care what you do because you can't build a laser station. Let's get Geneva back and 744. That's where the science went then. Uh, go to Sasi, Sasa. Two turns, we'll go next turn, and then we'll get all her diplomatic favor from her. She's at 179. Eleanor, we're friends. I cannot allow you to... There is just no possible way. Yeah, she's not willing to... Okay. What if I just... Cuck you? What if I just cuck you a little bit? Okay, she really wants that. All right, well, I'm going to have to pray that the AI is smart enough to cancel her shit or else we lose the game. Let's go next turn. Um, oh, God damn it. God damn it. How many can she get? This is going to be automatic. One, two, three, four, five. If she gets every single one, she wins. Eleanor wants this outcome. Okay. Um, she doesn't have the most favor. Pakatui does. So... We're going to try to get Pakatui. World Games is obviously going to be yes, so that's an automatic one for her. She's at 15 right now. Um, government type gains a wildcard policy slot. I don't know what government she has, but I highly doubt she has communism. Let's see if we can get that to work. And promotion time. Let's try to get this melee. Ah, uh, this could be it. Perfect. She didn't get anything. Or she probably got some stuff, but still, doesn't really matter. Uh, does the world's game give diplomatic victory points? One diplomatic victory point. How many? She has 60. Okay, perfect. Perfect. We have 30 turns. That is more than enough time. We are going to win this in less than... Okay, there's a laser station. Traveling now two light years per turn. Yeah, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. That's fine. We won the game. It's over. Language laser station in two turns. Perfect. Perfect. Um, production. Five production. Nice. All right. Game over. Easy win. <laughs> Wasn't even worried in the slightest. Uh, there's future tech. 5% towards city projects. Let's just keep doing that over and over again. Um, transfer to Zion. Next turn. We are starting to build these lasers, laser stations out of our butts. Uh, there is another. And I have a good idea. Let's build another. Let's build a Langrange because it only costs aluminum. Uh, 5 production. And 5 production. There we go. Two turns, we'll get another one. We're going to get one next turn. Uh, occupy one of their ally cities. That is fine. You want money. I'm not going to do any trade with you. Not yet. Uh, we do have the most money in the game, I think. There's another one. And boom, there it is. 25 population in one city. Absolutely massive. More laser stations. We are traveling at four. Probably around five or six light years per turn. No one else is close to any other victory type. So I think this is going to be it. Don't want to toot my own horn, though. Uh, build another one. We'll go next turn again. Um, yeah. No one else is building anything. Damn. All right. Future tech again. Unit needs orders. More production is what we need. 
uh, city range attack. Could not care less. That is a submarine, though. Haven't seen one of those in a while. I do exclusively play on Pangea, though, so that's probably why. Uh, okay, next turn. I just play on Pangea because it's just easier. I don't want to have to deal with a navy. Hey, you pillage my stuff. How can a submarine pillage if it's just going to be underwater the entire time? Anyway, that is another project completed. Just production. If it's five production, you go to it. If not, you're going to look for four production. Five production, boom. Begin the route. Production-wise, uh, another laser station. We are now traveling at probably around seven. Um, okay. Let me get a few more in a while. There we go. Uh, we are traveling at seven probably around. So two more turns and it is going to be GG game over. Maybe three. We'll see. Uh, 26 population. Now that is massive. Massive population gains in my capital. Uh, future tech. We'll go to future tech again. Population. You almost have everything worked. Damn. Trust your laser station. You are at eight light years per turn. That should be it don't care what anybody else does there we go giant death robot jump all the way and scare molly that should do it i think there we go easy science victory definitely helps that we essentially took out two sieves in the early game uh that's china we got louis xv after me the flood we are close to getting charles de gaulle but it's fine one of these days, I'm going to do a series on exclusively getting the highest score possible. But, we'll leave that for another day. As you can see from everything, it was just... Player science just absolutely exploded and never let up. Player score, it was a little closer than usual. Era score, close. Governors, as you can see, we completely dominated this entire game. We lost about... It looks like four or five units, and we've killed about... 26, so not the best game when it comes to uh, KDA, I guess, with units. Um, but I did lose a lot because India just had a superior military, technologically, compared to me. That's going to do it for my end. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed. I'll probably be playing... Um, we'll see. I'm not too sure yet. But yeah, I'll see you all in the next video series.